Hi, so today we'll learn how to do an animated texture effect inside of After Effects. So without further ado, let's get started. So I have already opened up my composition. I've made three ellipses here. Uh, but for this tutorial, we'll just use one of them for now and see how this goes. So we'll hide the other ellipses and this is what we'll work with. So first of all, you need to create a new solid, which is just right click here, go to new, go to solid, make it black color or white, depending on what kind of shadow color you want. I'll go with orange here. I want an orange shadow over here. So as you can see, the orange solid has been created. Now just move it above the layer you're working with and then apply an effect called set matte. Just drag it onto the solid layer and then change the source value from orange to the layer you're working with. So ellipse three for now. Now you can see the orange color only affects the part of the ellipse, right? So this is basically a mask. Now what we need to do is create a mask inside of the solid, right? So we go to the pen tool while this is selected, we will draw the shadow. We'll draw how we want the shadow to look like. So now we have created this mask. I am happy with it now. So we'll go and adjust the feather a little bit. So just select the layer and click on F on your keyboard and this should pop up. Now just add a little bit of feather. So now the gradient is a little smooth. It looks like kind of a shadow, but we'll make it texturized, right? So for that, we need an effect called scatter. So basically there are multiple ways of doing this, but I prefer using scatter. Now what you need to do, as you can see, the effect has been applied. Now what you need to do is change the scatter mount. But now you will see once you change the scatter amount, the scatter goes outside of the circle. What you need to do is pull the set matte effect above scatter. So that will keep the scatter inside of the frame, right? So now just add some scatter value. I'll go with a very high value here so that we can like achieve our effect here. So I'm going with 694, the grain to both and we'll randomize scatter every frame. Now we'll see that the scatter and animation might be very fast for us. It is very fast for us. So what you need to do is basically go and apply an effect called posterize time to this layer and make it to 12. So this will animate in 12 frames per second. This is also fast. Let's make it like maybe one frame a second. Yes, I think this looks good now. I think this is what we needed. Uh, we can make it like maybe two frames a second. Yep, I think this works for me. Now what we need to do is basically go ahead and make the same effect for the other two ellipses and we'll be good to go. We'll have a great, great, great effect here. So I think that's pretty much it. This is a very basic and very easy tutorial on how to do animated texture inside of After Effects. You can go ahead and use this effect for any text layers, any kind of layers you have. So I hope this helps you. Thank you very much for watching this video. This has been Satyajit. See you in the next one.